We're all familiar with the phrase, the sky's the limit, but that's not going to be the case over at the newly renovated Strassenburg Planetarium at the Rochester Museum and Science Center. Josh Navarro tells us you can now boldly go where no man has gone before. Welcome to the new Strassenburg Planetarium. So what's new about it? The upgrade is in the details. The For example, the brand new space show called Outer Space to Inner Space starts with a close view of Rochester, then zooms out to view the entire planet Earth and beyond. The museum president and CEO hopes the new upgrade will not only draw in more visitors, but spark an interest to folks who explore the stars. And what we really want is for them to learn about the solar system, about the night sky, about the stars, and then go outside at night and see it for themselves. It's a major $1.2 million digital upgrade. The money came from private donors and from the state of New York. The new system, called Digistar 6, receives up to the minute data from NASA, NOAA, the U.S. Geological Survey, plus the National Science Foundation, so that audiences can enjoy the view of the planets up close and in real time. Our staff and the audience when they first see how modern this is just light up with interest at last we're in the modern world this is something that works in a modern way the planetarium's original star projector carl isn't going anywhere it'll also be making appearances throughout the shows the planetarium reopens tomorrow at 10 o'clock in the morning and they're expected to have 20 shows a week in rochester i'm josh navarro news 8. Josh, thank you. The planetarium plans to have a special viewing of the upcoming lunar eclipse happening on January 20th, plus a Beatles laser show in February. You're going to